Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel, and uh, we have more nightmare stories as we are moving through a uh, era where Windows 11, when installed from scratch, will turn on BitLocker and encrypt your files on your device, and um, it is more and more uh, a problem for some users. Um, by going through uh, some Reddit posts, I've seen you know users um, just losing years of personal pictures, for example. Why? Because Microsoft decided that BitLocker needed to be turned on, and PC crash. They don't have the key. They don't have a way to get anything. And of course, Microsoft does not have any way of to help you with that. Uh, another interesting user, and you know what? I was victim of this about uh, maybe two years ago, I'd say two to three years ago, there was something that happened uh, to the Microsoft account and I got locked out. They were telling me that I had done something illegal with my Microsoft account, which I did not. And I can't even see what I did that could have locked it out. And so on Reddit, there are several users that say, well, you know, just shuffling around uh, files in the um, in the cloud in OneDrive uh, from their PCs and all of that, they've got locked out of their accounts, and because of that, they lost their files uh, both on their PC and on the uh, the OneDrive. Uh, that's not counting that if we don't talk about just purely you know BitLocker. Uh, some got locked out of their account. Their files were all on OneDrive, no backup, and uh, they got locked out, which meant they had no access, which meant they lose all their files. So, you know what? There's a huge problem with that. Um, I don't think the idea of turning on BitLocker, first of all, is good. Microsoft should never, never have done that. Uh, let users turn it on if they wish to do so. I understand the idea behind it is not bad and, and that, you know, by having encrypted files, you're more secure, but for most people, it doesn't really matter. And I think that really should be something that the user does. Same with backing up on the cloud. Look at people blank backing up stuff on the cloud and for some reason, they get locked out of their account. There's nothing they can do. And a lot of them, and I was witness to that, I, I filled out the form to unlock my account uh, several times with no answer, with nothing happening. My account personally got unlocked when I started going to Microsoft blogs and uh, Microsoft groups and complaining, putting my email, putting my info, saying that, you know, I, I pay for Xbox uh, the Xbox Game Pass, I pay for Microsoft Office, that I can't even have any service, nobody can actually help me, I can't talk to anyone about my account, and I just bombarded the different places that I could from Microsoft with all of that. Then, oh, miracle, 24 hours, my account was unlocked. And with only one thing, and I don't e still don't even know what happened, the account was unlocked with the message, don't do that again. What did I do? I don't know. <laughs> I didn't do anything. It's, it's so weird. It's as if the machine, you know, went berserk and for some reason it thought I was doing something wrong. I don't know. Uh, but this is uh, something that, um, you know, I think is important to understand that BitLocker should not be on and that uh, you should always have a backup of your different files and folders and pictures somewhere not in any account or and not in the cloud only if you enjoy my videos please subscribe give us thumbs up thank you for watching